Welcome to Represent Radio 107.3 FM, and I'm here with a special guest. A very special guest. Hi. Seven Street is in the building. What's good? How are you? I am absolutely amazing. How are That's you? That's good. I'm very nervous right now. I can't lie. Why are you nervous? Because you're Seven Street. Or, like, what, do you, <laughs> what do you mean? But, like, you, but you relic. So maybe I should. Ooh, should I be nervous too? Ooh, she said my name's sick. I can't lie. I guys. think I should be nervous too. No, nah, no, not at all. Not at all. Not at all? I'm, I love your accent. Not at all. I've been trying to talk like y'all all day. What's your best? Give us your best. English it's accent. not good. Only word that I even I've been saying repeatedly, Go on. and my team is probably tired of me is saying literally. Literally. Yeah, that's See? it. That was good though. It was decent. That was good. <laughs> it was decent. It was decent. Is this your first time in London? It's my first time in London. Really? Yeah, first time in London, and wow. I'm so excited. It's my first show. Yes. Like I am like so freaking excited for it yeah. tonight. Like it, I'm just I'm like I'm about to have a heart attack. I'm that excited. <laughs> Don't know. You have a heart attack. Yes. Your fans will be like, "Well, she's meant to be here," and you know what I'm saying. Listen, oh. I'm having the best time. So what have you what have you enjoyed so far about London? Um, you know what? I've just been... Well, you want to know the craziest thing? I just saw the queen. What, the actual queen? Yes. We drove past uh, Buckingham Palace. And as we were driving, we were, at, we were at the red light. And this caravan came in. Yeah. And right next to the gate... Well, we were right on, like, right outside the gate, obviously, in the car. Yeah. And um, she drove... Rode, they drove in. And she was, like, wearing, like, this cute little pink suit and this cute little pink hat. See? Yeah. I've lived there 23 years. I've never seen the queen. You've been here for five minutes. Shut and seen up. The Are you serious? I've never seen the queen. That, Ever in person. No way. Never in Is person. it, like, a rare sighting thing? I think so. Because she has, like, 100 rooms in her palace. So why would you want to leave? You I would never saying? leave. Exactly. I would never go I would nowhere. sleep in every, a different room every night. I would def- that was just because I can. Just because you can, you know right? What I'm Use a different bathroom every night. Too. Exactly. Why just because you can. Exactly. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> so you're obviously excited about your first show in the UK. I How long am... do you want to come out here? Um, forever. Yeah. Literally for for years at this point. Like I, like I literally, I'm, I've been asking you know teams of mine and people yeah. of mine for years. Like when am I gonna go to London? When am I gonna go to UK? And it just it never happened. But I made it happen. Good. <laughs> like good. it happened. Good. Yeah. Good, good. Good. Now you've got a single out now. I do. Is it what's it called? I do. I do. Yearning. I do. It's my baby called Yearning. Yes. How yes. did you write that with? Um, I wrote that record with this writer named City. He's from Philly, and another writer named Lonnie Burrell, and he's from LA. Sick. Yeah. Do you wanna get into the track? Do you wanna intro we it? We sure can. What up, you guys? It's your girl Seven Streeter, and this is my new baby. My new single is called Yearning. Right here, hanging out with my boy Relic. <laughs> 